Yeah. Hi, we're Heavy Metal Beer Club. And today we're drinking Two Brothers Amplifier. Feedback Hazy IPA. I love that name. That's very cool. It is so cool. Do you it's remember? Feedback from um, a speaker the from the guitar. Yeah. From the guitar. Hey, spray lead lead guitar. That's a 5.9% alcohol by volume. And they're out of Warrenville, Illinois. Now, do you remember our the second video that we ever did, the tasting video? We did it from Casa Video. And we had a Two Brothers beer. And we were already in a few beers. And I just completely botched up the name. So now. I don't, I don't remember yeah, that. Yeah, we did. And so, but I put it, I wrote at the bottom, the Two Brothers. Because they bought the uh, Monkey Shines recipe from that oh, local okay. brewery two brothers here in Tucson, bought the from Nimbus, shine. yes, oh, okay. yeah, two brothers, and I, I have to say, I feel bad, you know, being from Tucson and that Nimbus was here in Tucson, but I'll have to say the two brothers monkey shine was actually better. It was very, very good. I remember you saying that. Yeah, I liked it a lot. I was always a Monkey Shine fan. I would say that's kind of like a dull yellow. It's a little bit slightly, it's not completely clear. Like it's uh, it's hazy. Well, it is a it is a hazy IPA after all, right? It's a nice golden hazy. It definitely looks hazy. Can't wait to try this one. Give that a smell first. You got a smell. Oh, it's yeah, hazy. it's uh, definitely citrusy. You get that right away. Yeah, it smells so good. Yeah. Very fruity. Very, very grapefruit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, the grapefruit stands out yeah, a lot to me. You get the old grapefruit sniffer. I'm even getting peach, peach out of it as well. Peach, a little bit of pineapple. Yeah, pineapple for sure. It's a little passion fruity. A little passion fruity. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's get it. It smells a good. Taste. Cheers. That's what it's all about. Yeah, cheers. Yeah. That's really good. That's a great flavor explosion. Yeah. Right? First, take a sip of it. Has a light uh, mouthfeel. Mm-hmm. Yeah, nice light mouthfeel. Mouth, mouth feel. <laughs> it's very good. I, I'm enjoying it. I this. still, I get more grapefruit out of the scent than I do out of the taste. Mm -hmm. It's just slightly on the grapefruit, mm -hmm. but it's, very citrusy. It's more on the passion fruity side with when you taste, but that's why you can't always rely on the what scent. it yeah. smells like. You gotta taste. Maybe a little tangerine. Yeah. Gives it that tangy taste. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Slight tangerine in the, in the flavor yeah. as well. Yeah, it's a little more on the tangerine side of an IPA, I would say. And on the tasty meter, which is a scale of one through five, what on, would you say? On the tasty meter of one through five, I'd give this a 4.3. I'm enjoying it. Wow. And I, I've been higher than you lately on stuff, which isn't uh, the usual. I was, I, I'd say a 4.5 for me. Very good. You know, you know what, I though? I go there. I love He's got on his iPad the two brothers craft with a conscience, and it's like showing this bacon cheeseburger. Look, okay, well, right. we got to read up more. It says two brothers coffee roasters, even. We, we What's need going to go on there? there? We yeah, need and a it road looks trip. like they have a few different locations. It's in the Chicago area. We need a heavy metal beer club road, road trip. trip. Yeah, we got to go. We know you guys are just going, why didn't you go here? Why didn't you go there? We keep getting this feedback thing. <laughs> Why, you, go here, go there. Yeah, yeah okay, try this will. place, I'm not try that place. not the names because we're keeping it quiet for now. But we're going to hit it up. So you'd be surprised. Hey, did you see what I was wearing? My Mad Monster Freddy Krueger. Yeah, Mad Monster, yes, we love you, we Mad Monster. just there and we went a day early to go see a fan film, Dylan's New Nightmare. It's a oh. night, Nightmare on Elm Street fan film. Fan, fan film. film. And uh, they did it in conjunction with Womp Stomp Films, which yeah. they did, if you haven't seen Never Hike Alone or Never so Hike good. Alone in the Snow, it's which so is good. a Friday the 13th fan film. You got it. I, I had oh to buy gosh, it. Oh my gosh, I should have worn YouTube. my Freddy sweater today. You can, you can see it on YouTube, but I had to buy the um, Never Hike Alone because I like physical it's copies. Good. We wish so. we had bought the second one too. But we got to see the premiere of Dylan's New Nightmare. Yes. Put together, produced by none other than Cecil Laird and the Horror Show Channel. And it was awesome. Yeah, the acting, we're not going to give away any spoilers. Mm -hmm. The acting was just incredible. I loved it. The actors were there. Yeah, it the was makeup, awesome. the makeup artist, she did a fantastic job, of course. 
Yes. And the actor She's playing so Freddy talented. was outstanding. It was completely like watching a new uh, Nightmare on Elm Street film. It was that professional. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was, it was fantastic. Awesome. So and that should be out. The people that made it are so into it, and they're true fans. And so that really comes through all the hard work they put into it, and it's just. It's awesome. We yeah, look it. it up on the Horror Show channel. I'm going to have a link in the description below so you can look up Dylan's new nightmare and find out a little bit more about it if you're into horror movies because we are huge horror fans. And so that was a must-see. We had to go early and see the premiere of it, and, and we were very happy. Yes, indeed. Please hit the like button and follow us if you're not, and we'd really appreciate that. And you'll have a good time. Or Freddy's going to get you. Cheers. Cheers! Have you met a beer club? But we got to premiere Dylan's new nightmare. Oh, oh. who's calling us now? It must be Ghostface. <laughs> Those sons <laughs> of <laughs> 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 Okay, so let's go. Okay.